everyone, it's Miss Erin with another Steam at Home video and this week we're going to make some plastic cup launchers. What you need for this are two plastic cups, any size will do but standard size is probably the best. You're going to need some scissors and I will say that if you're doing this and you're a younger kid you want to have a grown up help you because you do need some sharper scissors to cut through the plastic cup. You need two rubber bands and some heavy duty tape. So to make your launcher, you're gonna have one plain cup that you're just gonna do nothing with, except turn it upside down. I'll move it aside for now. I'm gonna take my sharp scissors and I'm going to make four little notches. I don't wanna to cut too far down. And I say this because I made my prototype earlier and I think I cut too far down as it doesn't launch as high as I would like it to. So we just need a little cut, and if it does go too far down, that's why you have some heavy duty tape. You're gonna take your tape and cut off some pieces. Mine is duct tape. And you want to reinforce the bottom of the cut. So if it cut too far like mine, you can put the tape over it. Make it a little bit stronger there. And if you need to put some inside, you can put some inside as well. So you wanna make sure you cut all four of the, or tape up all four of the cuts you made. Like so. And then, when you have all of your tape, all of your cuts taped up, which my tape does not want to come off the roll. There we go. You wanna take your two rubber bands, and you don't need very large rubber bands, but you can test the thickness, and you can try it with the thickness of a couple different kinds of rubber bands uh, and see what you think works best. I picked some pretty, th I picked some of my thicker ones to see what would happen. Okay, finally got it taped up. Take your rubber bands and cut them. You want them to be a long string. So two long strings. And then you're going to tie knots at the ends of both of them. I found it easier to tie the knot in one end, put it in my cup, and then knot the other end. So I got it in. This is also where working with a grown-up or a an older um, like a teenager or an older sibling can help because this plastic can be kind of sharp too. So I put my one string in. I'm gonna put my other rubber band string in on this side and knot it on this side. So I'm going to create an X inside. Just like this. Then I take my other cut. And you can put a design on here if you want to make it a rocket or something else that you want to send up into space. And you put it over top of here. You notice how it there's some tension. So if I press down on it and I let it go, it flies up in the air. I didn't press down very hard. I didn't want it to go very far. Just be very careful when you're launching things that you have nobody around that is going to get hurt. If it pops out, pop it right back in place. Press a little gentler that time and send it off. You can try more than one cup, which one bounces better. Again, try to change the thickness of your rubber bands, put rockets on it, whatever else you feel like you wanna send up into space and have a wonderful week. As always, share with us on our Facebook page, Sharpsburg Community Library, your creations. See you next week.